Hi everyone, it's me Lina again. Welcome to my YouTube channel and thank you a lot for checking my videos out. And today in this video I'd like to make a review on Arborean BB creams. Actually super BB creams because it's a special line that has a stronger coverage or it covers better than other BB creams from this brand. Though I haven't tried any other ones, I just uh, figured that this one's gonna be perfect for my uh, skin. And also I heard a lot of good things about uh, BB creams from Arborean brand. To be fair, I'm very satisfied with uh, this product. I now have uh, it in two different shades, that is Nude and Claire. And the thing is, Claire I got kind of by mistake, but I would say that it still suits my skin all right. I'm actually wearing right now the Claire one, so you can kind of judge. So Claire one has a pinkish undertone while um, Nude has a yellow undertone. And to be fair, I noticed that my uh, body skin has a yellow undertone, but my face actually is a bit pinkish uh, due to the fact that my skin is very sensitive. And I would say that my face actually has kind of this pinkish undertone, but because foundation or BB cream is supposed to um, I would say match your, for example, your uh, cleavage, your neck. I mean, I think that nude suits me better and you can actually see the way it looks on my face in my other video, it was semi-recently I actually made a review on this cream, on this BB cream. It was review of a smaller version of nude super BB cream and I'm wearing that shade in that video. So all in all, my opinion on this uh, Super BB cream didn't really change. I think it looks very nice on skin. I think that it is great for skin, like it's almost like skincare rather than makeup, which is amazing. It consists lots of good things for your skin and also my uh, skin feels very comfortable with this product. And I would say that I can't feel it on my skin at all, which is great. Also, I would say that it is rather a bit liquidish. It's not very like hard. If you would apply those shades on your like um, hand or drops of those products, uh, they look almost the same. I'm gonna try doing it, but once you actually blend those products, you can see that this one has pinkish undertone. This one has yellow. I'm right now wearing this one, which is Claire one. Uh, important thing is uh, those BB creams have SPF 20, which in my opinion is amazing. In the past, I used to like to use foundations, BB creams that have SPF, because, you know, I think it's a good thing uh, that it can protect you from sun. So anyways, let's just try to put little drops, like apply little drops on. So this is... Um, nude actually it's not such a small drop now when i see let's do this one just a bit i don't want to use too much of it <laughs> i'm so greedy uh i don't know yeah there is actually a little difference but both of them kind of look grayish when you look at the drops simply at the drops they look kind of like grayish i'm gonna try to blend them so the one I just blended is the clear one and let's just do, I'm gonna blend this one. So this is the way they look. The yellowish one is nude and this one kind of is pinkish undertone, is clear. For some reason the clear one actually looked a bit darker on my face, which I was kind of surprised, but it's not supposed to and I think in fact, when uh, I saw advertisement of this product, I noticed that people with lighter uh, complexion were wearing actually clear ones. So for me, it's a little bizarre, but it does sometimes look kind of like darker than nude on my face, which is very interesting. The texture is very pleasant. Everything about this cream is amazing. The only thing I can tell I don't like, and it still remains so, because I mentioned it in previous video, is that it kind of gives your skin this dewy effect, um, shiny. It makes your uh, face have this uh, healthy shine. I don't like it personally because it makes some of my um, wrinkles, I would say, stand out, in my opinion. That's how I feel about it. 
and I do still use powder. I prefer uh, most of my face uh, to look matte and yeah i don't like when it's you know like super shiny in certain areas let's put it this way even though i like using highlighter and so on but this is how i feel and this is one thing i don't like rather or i'm not like a big fan of uh when it comes to those uh super bb creams so the proper amount because it's 40 milliliters and the smaller one versions that i had actually previously and i showed you in my other review I think it was 18 milliliters so it's just you know to try and see it so those are boxes I still kind of kept to show you you can guess which one is which I guess by the color but it also says actually nude and uh, clam so I was gonna maybe read something for you from here BB creams half skincare half makeup expertise boosted to effectively camouflage and clear imperfections without feeling caked on reveal your baby skin no mask effect yeah i would kind of agree to all this but of course it still depends how much you apply it and yeah but you know i love that it feels on my skin and i feel like it doesn't clog my pores i feel like it doesn't cause any acne or anything like that so i really like it so half makeup uh, providing more coverage than the original bb cream so this is what i've been talking about so it says that it has light formula but yeah i agree totally it's very lightweight ingredients seem to be really nice bb creams from this brand are recommended by you know lots of people who know a lot about the type of things skincare and makeup i heard that many many times Super BB combines two Korean super ingredients, white uh, ginseng, fermented uh, ginseng flower. Hope I pronounced it correctly. I know what it means, but I'm not sure if I pronounced it correctly. In a formula that instantly reveals a smoother and moisturized skin. I totally agree. It actually moisturizes your skin. Also, it reduces imperfections, pimples, pores, blackheads, etc. Apparently, there is also niacinamide in it, which is really amazing. Anyways, on my rating from 1 to 10, I would give this product 9 stars out of 10. I think that nude uh, shade suits me more and I explain why. You can though decide which one suits you and I hope this video was helpful. Let me know what you think. Perhaps you have some questions to ask. I'll be glad to answer them as soon as possible. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like this video, comment and I'll see you soon. Yeah, 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 yeah.